The magical cat who can talk. In a far away land, there lived an old cat named Felix. He had a secret that no one knew about, he could talk. One day, Felix stumbled upon a group of children playing in the forest. They were Lily, Max, and Leo. The children were surprised when they heard the cat talking to them. Felix was happy to find some new friends, and the children were overjoyed to have a talking cat as their friend. The children loved spending time with Felix and would often visit him in the forest. One day, as they were playing hide and seek, they stumbled upon a small fairy named Flora. Flora was delighted to see the children and invited them to her home. She showed them around her garden and told them stories of her magical adventures. As they were leaving Flora's garden, Felix noticed that Flora looked sad. He asked her what was wrong and she told him that her magical wand was missing. Without her wand, she couldn't perform any magic. The children felt sorry for Flora and promised to help her find her wand. They searched the forest for hours, but they couldn't find Flora's wand. Just as they were about to give up, Felix came up with an idea. He suggested that they should ask the animals of the forest if they had seen the wand. The children thought it was a great idea and followed Felix. As they walked, they came across a big, mean-looking dog named Spike. Spike was known to be very aggressive and had a bad reputation. Felix tried to talk to Spike, but he wouldn't listen. Spike growled at the children and told them to leave. Just as they were about to leave, they saw something glinting in the sunlight. It was Flora's wand. Spike had been using it as a chew toy. The children were thrilled to have found the wand, but they knew they had to get it back to Flora before it was too late. They sneaked into Spike's yard and managed to retrieve the wand without being seen. As they were leaving, Spike caught them and started barking. The children were scared, but Felix stepped in and talked to Spike. He told him about Flora and how important the wand was to her. Spike who had a soft spot for fairies, decided to help the children. Together, they took the wand to Flora. Flora was overjoyed to see her wand and thanked the children for their help. She decided to repay them by granting them a wish each. Lily wished for a new doll, Max wished for a bike, and Leo wished for a puppy. As they were leaving, Felix told Flora that he had a secret. He told her about his ability to talk and how he had kept it a secret for all these years. Flora was amazed and promised to keep the secret safe. From that day on, the children visited Flora and Felix often. They had many magical adventures together but they never forgot the day they helped Flora find her wand. They knew that together, they could conquer any challenge that came their way. And Felix, he was happy to have found some new friends who accepted him for who he was, a magical cat who could talk.